Hello, young Tyro. Welcome to Historica, where learning is fun. My name is Mr. Olson. I am a fourth grade teacher at Lincoln Elementary, which is located in Lincoln, North Dakota, and you have scanned my fact storm. I am here today to tell you a little bit about Helen Keller. I want you to imagine what it would be like to be deaf, meaning you cannot hear. I also want you to imagine what it would be like to be blind, meaning you cannot see. Helen Keller was an individual who was both deaf and blind. That's right. When she was about 10 months old, her parents discovered that something just wasn't right. They then discovered that she was both deaf and blind. Here you will see a picture of Helen Keller meeting with former president Dwight D. Eisenhower. As you can see, she is touching his face because she learned a lot through touch because she could not see. When discussing the life of Helen Keller, it is also important to mention the name Annie Sullivan. Miss Sullivan began working with Helen in 1887. She taught her how to communicate effectively and many other things that contributed to the life of Helen Keller. She was later known as the miracle worker because of all the work that she did for Helen Keller throughout her lifetime. Here is a brief timeline of the life of Helen Keller. It is once again important to realize everything she was able to accomplish despite being deaf and blind throughout her entire life. If you liked this lesson, you can find me, my students, and my fourth grade classroom on Instagram at enthusiasm underscore is our jam. Thank you for learning with me in the land of Historica. Enjoy your battle.